Nashville, Virginia, where today two of the Commonwealth's basketball powers collide as the fourth ranked Cavaliers play host of VCU in a battle between two teams with just two losses total between them. Today, Virginia takes aim at a ninth straight win to start this season in a fourth straight over their in-state rival. VCU's defense has improved markedly here in the second year under Mike Rhodes. Nice little teardrop down low for Kyle Guy coming in from the left side. Braxton Key will feed it to Diakite. He shovels it off the left wing. Now it's Jerome driving inside the arc. He'll feed the right wing to Key. Spots up for three, lets it fly, and drills it. As we move inside of 12 minutes to go in a 10-9 game, Kyle Guy gets past his man, then lays it in with a reverse layup and the foul. In a missed layup underneath by Sean Bobley. He won't get it on a much more of a silver platter than that. DeAndre Hunter on the other side does it the hard way, sneaking his way down the lane and laying it in with a foul on the finger roll. Just 28% shooting to start this game for a Virginia team that's 5 of 18 guy. Catch and shoot three on the way. Got it. Kyle Guy, a three-pointer. He's had the hot hand for Virginia in this game. They dump it down low. Douglas feeds out. Now it's Evans on the left wing with eight to shoot. He's being hounded by the Mongoose himself. Kihei Clark gets a hand in his face. Shot misses short. Rebound picked up off the floor by Hunter. He will hand to Clark. That's why Jack Salt's in there getting those rebounds. Kihei Clark sees an opening. Goes up and under. What a shot as he goes right through the VCU defense and kisses it high in the air off the window and good. Ten to shoot now for Kyle Guy. Feeds into the corner. Open man. Jerome passed up on the three instead. Lobs out. Clark by himself, feeds it back to Jerome. Jerome hoists, hoists up the three, and he splashes it through from the near corner right. I know all of you are counting at home. Here's Diakita. Let nice move down the lane as he floats up the jump hook and puts Virginia on the board for the first time in the second half, and it took three and a half minutes. Now it's to Clark, bounce pass back to Diakite, and Diakite with a floater on the left baseline. What a comes up with another bucket. Now for Crowfield, he'll pass it back to left wing. Williams drives, attacks, gets past Hunter, and lays it in off the window. And that lead is five now for BCU. It's their largest lead of the game. That feels like a lot here in this game, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Here's Jerome attacking on the other side down the lane as he lays it high off the window and good. So Virginia finally gets a bucket, recognizing the moment to their feet here at John Paul Jones Arena. Kyle Guy on the right wing. He's defended by Crowfield. Drifts to his left. Beats Jerome. He fires up a long three and he rattles it through. Ty Jerome has tied the game at 43 points apiece with 5.35 to go. Five straight points from Virginia's junior. P.J. Berg going to turn it over. A 10 second violation. Couldn't get it across the midcourt stripe. Clark defended on the outside by Evans, down to Jerome. He puts up the three, he hits it, but foul was before the shot, I do believe. They're going to count for it. three. How about that? Ty Jerome will get credited with the three-pointer and the foul on the away from the ball. We have already seen 13 lead changes. Evans loses it on the deck. Kihei Clark, cast or otherwise, diving on it, forcing the held ball and pumping his fist as he tries to Try it free. Virginia's got it on the possession arrow. Kyle Guy will take the inbound pass. He'll hug the basketball, and Virginia will make its way to the victory here today. 57 to 49 as the Cavaliers close on a 19 to 6 scoring run.